I lost both of my legs below the knee and two fingertips. And um, I have really deep scars at nearly every joint. Meningococcal disease can be a devastating disease. Uh, it can cause symptoms and signs from shock to mental status changes to brain damage. It also can kill. It often causes limb loss, which means amputation of fingers, legs, arms, etc. I take about, well, I know I counted them this morning to make sure. I take 21 pills a day just to survive, and I'll be on most of them for the rest of my life. Meningococcal disease can present two major ways. First is with uh, a bacterial infection in the bloodstream. That is, a child comes in with uh, purple spots, little dots, or big hemorrhages on the skin, anywhere on the body, or it can present with meningitis. Meningitis is more the neck stiffness, the high fever, uh, the child has severe headaches. At Novartis, our vision is to eradicate meningococcal disease. Vaccination against meningococcal disease prevents people from getting sick, it prevents costs for the healthcare system, and also costs of taking care of severely disabled people who survive the disease. Menvio was just recently FDA approved for the use in teens and adults 11 to 55 years old. This vaccine protects against four main types of meningococcus, A, C, Y, and W135. I was diagnosed with meningococcal meningitis when I was 14. I was away at a summer camp with a group of friends. We were hiking the Appalachian Trail. After coming back, within a few hours, I started to feel flu-like symptoms and just thought I had the flu. Thought really nothing of it. Um, and over the next two months, I had my hands amputated at the forearm. I had my legs amputated at the knee. I had uh, large amounts of skin grafts and I wasn't given much of a chance of survival. As a survivor, I hope that my story will help to tell other people that even though this is a very rare disease, it's still something that needs to be taken seriously.